Democracy is said to be the government of the people, for the people, and by the people. It is believed that peaceful protests are necessary ingredients in every democracy and are fundamental to the sanity of a democratic process. For about two weeks now, Nigerian youths have staged peaceful protests, tagged and SARS against what they called police brutality that had characterized the operations of the special anti-robbery squad, SARS, of the Nigerian police. We can go about our peaceful protests, carry placards, show our grievances. That is welcome by democracy. It's okay. Show what you want. And SARS, okay. We want uh, uh, youth uh, inclusiveness in government. Okay. It is not out of place for any people in society to demonstrate. As a first step to show his commitment to extensive police reforms, President Muhammad Buhari ordered the Inspector General of Police, Mohamed Adamu, to quickly disband SARS. The IGP did and substituted with, with SWAT, the Special Weapons Attack Team, but the protesters were not impressed. The National Executive Council weathered in and directed states to constitute state-based judicial panel of inquiries to look into the extrajudicial killings by the SARS. With all these measures, the protesters still did not leave the streets, and some criminals and miscreants have hijacked the protest to unleash mayhem in the country. In order not to allow anarchy, some states are shutting down schools and imposing curfew, while the IGP has directed immediate national redeployment of anti-riot police officers. What advice do some stakeholders have for this use at this point in time? We should say to the youth to stay out of crime and then behave as responsible citizens of Nigeria. We begin to train our children to know how to behave and how to do things rightly. And our politicians also themselves to behave and do things with modesty. Until Nigerians, we are black people, until we know that we do not have any other land except this land where we are. While we go about showing our grievances to government, for government to hear us, we should not destroy the utilities or burn down cars that belong to individuals or go and attack people on the roads or rob shops or do all sorts of things. Every life is important. We do not want to lose lives. In trying to pacify the youths, the respondents have urged them not to destroy the democratic process. It was also their views that law enforcement agencies should maintain standard rules of engagement in Enugu, Chine, Nwoye, NTA News.